you're telling me you were outside on the picnic table. I don't think you were. I think you were inside on that bookcase leaving rings. You know what I got for you? This is called a tabaret, I'm pretty sure. This is loosely based off of a design that I saw on the Woodwright shop, Roy Underhill's show. And the drawing that I'm doing is definitely not the scale. I wanted to make sure that you were going to be able to see the octagon shape at the top. Now I do live in an earthquake zone, so it probably would have been better to make this into more of a pyramid shape, so it was stable. But I'm trying to keep this project simple. Here I'm cutting all the legs to length, the top pieces as well as the two cross pieces for the center. If you're going to drop a clamp on your foot, make sure you get it out of the way early, like I did. I'm using a shooting board to true them up and a hand plane to square them. I want to make sure at this point that all my legs are at the same exact length. glue up the top pieces. Use a chisel to remove the glue when it's done and plane it square and flat. I had to saw an extra half inch off the side. Use a marking knife to shape the octagon and saw it off. Clean the saw cuts up. There's really only two types of joint in this project. There's the rebate at the top or rabbit, and there's a half lap for the cross at the bottom. So saw out the half laps and then saw out the rebates. I just used a saw, a coping saw, and a chisel to create these joints. Here I'm using the legs and the top piece to get the cross pieces to their proper lengths. I made my rabbits or rebates a little bit long so that I'd be able to round them over. And the most important part, play with your shop dog. Yes, I used a power drill to drill my pilot holes. Unfortunately, I don't have anything else yet that will hold a bit that small. And then I nailed the legs on. And I tightened everything up with a nail set. Just like last week with a dog food stand, I used a few flash coats of shellac for the finish and cleaned it up with steel wool. Yeah, he was sitting on my bookcase that I made a few weeks ago. I'm sure you may have seen that video. If not, check it out. Um, pretty happy with it. It's a little skewed. I want to thank you for watching me make a fool of myself. Please subscribe, leave a comment, give me a like. Uh, check out my website, uh, yayhippo.com slash cleanfillwanted. It'll be in the description. Well, thanks for watching. Have a good week. Taking this inside. Oh. <laughs>